Hello, YouTube people. Okay, so I know I have not gotten on here. I have not made any type of video. I have not been making any kind of effort. But uh, we're going to make some effort. Um, today, my boyfriend was like, you need a hobby. And I was like, like, like I do have a hobby and like, you know, I wanted to do these videos and I'm thinking, why am I not doing them? And I don't really know. I think it's because like, as I've gotten older, I don't really like being so public about myself. And I think that's why like, I don't want to go public. But, um, you know, I'm a mom. So sometimes I feel like I can't have fun or like, I don't know. But I mean, I'm, yeah, you can have fun. So, I don't know. Right now, uh, I guess we could talk about what's going on. Right now, what are we in June? Okay, so... My oldest baby is on summer break and we've just been making the most out of this summer. I've had the kids in um, swim lessons and my oldest in a uh, math tutoring, like a math help thing. And it's been working out well. Um, right now we're still in this apartment and it's driving me nuts because I, I've never lived this long in an apartment and I'm trying to be grateful that I even have a roof over my head, but I cannot stand it. I can't, I can't, mm -mm. I don't like it. Um, I didn't put anything in my hair before straightening it because it already has a lot of stuff in it and it does have, um, Heat protectant already in it. So, I don't know what else we could talk about. We could talk about mm, this new face cream I got. We could talk about that. I was running low uh, on my, what is it? It's a Sunday Riley CEO. It's like a, you know, it's like a face moisturizer brightening cream whatever i was running low on it and the serum and whatever so um i had tried a face mask by this lotus youth preserve and i was thinking well if their face mask is like great i was like i bet their moisturizer will be like pretty great too and then on top of that um i had been having allergies so i was thinking Okay, I've had allergies my whole life. I'm like, I need to invest in um, in like an eye cream for deep puffing, you know, dark circles or whatever. I went to Sephora and um, that's where I got the face cream too. And, you know, I'm just kind of browsing, talking to the girl. Um, and I'm trying, like, I, I go in bare face and I'm trying, you know, these creams, kind of seeing how they are, whatever. And then I started thinking, wait. Sunday Riley's products were so great. Um, so then I start looking and they do have an eye cream and it's this right here. It's called Auto Correct by Sunday Riley. It has, it says caffeine, lutein, and horse chestnut. Brightening and deep puffing eye contour cream. Instantly delivers a lifted and deep puffed look while reducing the appearance of dark circles and fine lines. And it does exactly that. It does it so well. I have not put any on today. Um, but like, shoot. If you're somebody who suffers with like baggy eyes, I'm telling you, this stuff is great. I've had bags under my eyes since elementary because i've been i'm like an allergy asthma sufferer but i'm telling you that stuff is good so i mean those are the only things i've been using right now this face cream also you can use it at night i mean 
Uh, it does not have any SPF in it. So, um, I was using, it's a drugstore one and it's red. I forgot what it's called, but it's really good. But that one has SPF in it and that's what I put on my face for SPF because where I live, the sun is out right now. It's crazy. It is hot. I was outside just for a little bit and I put, um, what is it? Sunscreen on and I am like, I tanned. But, um, yeah, I like those. And um, I don't really have like a ton of, you know, different face products because I kind of like to use the ones that I have because let's be honest, uh, they're expensive. And if it's good, then I mean, why would you need anything else? But I mean, there's just so many creams and stuff you could put on your face. I do use a face wash. I forgot. I forgot who it's from. But I mean, um, their line, my face wash that I used. I wish I knew the name. Their line of products are so good, but it's so affordable. But um, with my face wash, um, that one doesn't have the salicylic acid in it. So um, I put a little bit of that one and I put my Neutrogena, it's like an orange pump, um, acne wash that has acetic acid in it. And I mix them because it's like medicine for your face. You know, it keeps the blemishes away, keeps my skin clear. And that's all I need. Um, that Neutrogena acne wash, the orange one, it got me through puberty and I swear by it. And you can find that like at a drugstore, um, I guess grocery store. We have H-E-B. Um, I know other places don't have H-E-B, but yeah, no. You can go to Kroger's, whatever else there is. And I just hate doing my hair now. I had a... Um, I had a Brazilian blowout done in my hair a couple of months ago. I can't remember which month, but um, it kind of made my hair, I have curly hair, it kind of made it like more wavy and um, it was fine. I mean, it did exactly what it said it was supposed to do and I loved it. I could hop out the shower, um, you know, put some product in my hair and let it dry and like it would be okay. and. I could straighten it so quick, but it's like once my new growth started coming in, my new growth is like so much more curlier. Like see, it's starting, it's like curly and it's getting harder to do my hair. And the reason I haven't gone back to get a Brazilian blowout is because those are kind of pricey and I feel guilty sometimes when I, um, uh, do stuff like that and I don't know um, my curly hair is really pretty and I want to grow it out but that's gonna take forever so I don't really know what I want to do so yeah um, I'm also gonna be moving soon because I don't like it here so hopefully we'll be moving into a house I don't know I hope but um searching for a house is so much it's so much more stressful than looking for an apartment and it's a big commitment and I'm sure it's gonna be a whole process and I just like oh. but I mean if you want it bad enough I mean, you'll go get it. You'll go get it. So that's what I'm gonna do. But yeah, and let's talk about this straightener. Sorry, <laughs> the 
this straightener okay it's called um my son got mascara on it that's why it looks like this but it's called titanium what is it called nano titanium it's by babyliss pro guys this straightener is the bomb if you have curly coarse hair this is great i know they have a more narrow one but i got the bigger plate so i could get more hair um i am a biracial i'm a african-american and um hispanic mexican so um i have like mixed curly hair and it's <clears throat> kind of coarse my hair is not too thick but it's not exactly too thin but I'm telling you guys, this is like the best straightener ever. And I think they even have a travel size um, of this. And I, I've used the Chi. I've used, um, there's this Revlon one like I got at Walmart. And that one was really nice too. But um, I don't know what made me want to get this. I forgot. But I think I got it. I got it last year, and I've been in love with it since. My sister's been in love with it. Um, sometimes it disappears from my restroom. But yeah, uh, I need to go get my eyebrows done. Uh, I just been on low energy today. Um, uh, I got my nails done. I had them put um. I guess the fake nail and then she did shellac and I mean I think she did a good job and everything but man she put my hand underneath that UV light like eight times per hand and I was like oh my gosh girl you're gonna give me cancer but I like the color because like it's shiny stands out but I think it's kind of bright I don't know but yeah so I guess I'm gonna finish my hair and then um, I guess put my extensions in because I do wear extensions um, but maybe we can do another video on my extensions because I don't know but I think that I make extensions blend really well I've been wearing extensions since I was in high school, but um, not from high school till now, but like, you know, every other year or whatever. Uh, my hair is almost getting to a point where I don't really think I need extensions, but I still like them for that extra like inch. Um, but I can make extensions blend pretty well, I think like color cut style placements so i don't know maybe i should do a better video on that maybe i'll use my camera and yeah so i'll make another video soon guys bye